find WMUR's Adam Sexton live tonight in Manchester to explain the very latest developments in this case. Adam. Well, Shelly and Tom, time is of the essence here as truly wintry weather arrives, and court documents indicate that Fred Fuller continues to operate on a day to day basis in which the cash flow from pre buy contracts and budget contracts come in and then is used to fund day to day operations. Beleaguered home heating giant Fred Fuller wants to expedite its sale to Rhymes Propane and Oil, taking a rapidly developing bankruptcy process to light speed. This is very fast. A court filing made Tuesday laid bare just how close Fuller Oil is to going out of business. Documents indicate it owes pre buy and budget customers more than $7 million worth of fuel oil. It is operating on a plan referred to by a bankruptcy judge as a cash flow bleed budget. And without the ability to burn that money, Fuller could close down on Monday. The fact is, the company has very little cash, and in order to continue ordinary course operations, it would need to raise uh, money either through a dip loan or an interim management loan uh, or a management agreement in which a buyer came in and took over the operations. Rhymes stands ready to assume control. Fuller attorney Bill Gannon says Rhymes will pay $12.5 million for Fuller and the company's namesake, Fred Fuller himself, won't make any money. In fact, court paperwork says he's giving up personal property holdings to make this deal work. As uh, an equity holder, Mr. Fuller is really last in line. Gannon claims the driving force behind this deal, which he calls fair under the circumstances, is the protection of consumers and Fuller employees. Now, according to a sales schedule attached to this court filing, Fuller and Rhymes will be filing a motion to authorize the sale on Thursday, and they'll have a hearing on that motion on Monday. Reporting live in downtown Manchester, Adam Sexton, WMUR News 9.